Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to La Mulana 2 tonight. Last time, we beat another boss. We got some more items. Uh, we got some more info. We grabbed, I think, two more dissonance things or whatever for a weird clay head thing. <clears throat> so we're kind of running out of places that we can go again for like the fourth or fifth time, but um, here's my thought on the matter. I think... I think we can probably complete Eternal Prison now. Um, so let's try it. Let's let's try it real quick here, and we'll find out like super soon if we can uh, actually complete it or not. Um, so I'm gonna start with Valhalla because so we're gonna go into Eternal Prison from um, the Blood Corridor entrance. Ouch! Excuse me. Oh, what the hey? Why is this all lit up and shit now? Um, excuse me. <laughs> why? Why is this lit up? Oh, uh, okay. Okay. Cool. I guess. Cool. I I'm sure that has no uh, no meaning. <laughs> oh boy. All right. So we've got like five of the seven things I think we need to complete this area. Right. We've got the chalice, which is going to be taken from us right now. I think. Right. Yeah. Um. And then the other six things we may or may not have. It's all right. So the chalice, whatever. Uh, the gleaming wrist guards are, are the little grippy gramps things, right? Hold on a second. Is there something we needed to do to get this guy to come to life again, too? I think so, right? There's just some guy like say a mantra or something. And he'll come running. Ah, fuck it. So anyways, uh, one thing at a time here. Let's let's see what we can do with this. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh right, actually before we do this, um, I want to move this over again. Oh, we gotta... what the hell? I didn't save from before? Cool. Oh, and then there's a... a traces of poison thing? What the hell? I didn't even see this. What is this? What is this over to the right here? Um, traces of poison seems to suggest that we should put this thing on. Ah, what is this? Excuse me. What have we discovered? We have discovered something of value, perhaps. Hmm. This is a brand new fucking area. Well, room, rather. Hey, oh my god, how you doing? Good to see you. Oh, and I heard a little dink dink there, too. What was that? Oh, something's getting hit there. Interesting. Can I walk through these things? Nope. <laughs> that still zaps me. Okay. Very good. Very good. Alright, what's in this door? Anyways, I have no business with, that, with, with those without proof of judgment. Oh, we gotta go get, um... I gotta go get Mott's Feather. Uh, shit. Oh, that's right. Uh, oh, we gotta go do go back and look at that room more closer, right? All right. So, so what the fuck? Where are we? <laughs> First of all, where the fuck are we? Okay, it's over here. This is uh, Anubis. Uh, need Mott's feather. All secrety secret thing right there. How dare they? How dare they hide this room from me? Um, okay, where was that other thing, then? <laughs> where was the other thing where we were getting judged or some bullshit? Uh... Where was that? That was, um... Was that Dark Star Lord's thing? Yeah, 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 okay. We're gonna have to go back and look at that, because I, I don't know what the fuck they want from me on that one. Oh, 
Okay, well, big, big clay thing doesn't, uh, protect you from spikerinos, apparently. That's all right. we get all of this in the correct order. So now I need to just push this over a little bit. Because this might be key after we lose our grippy gramps or our double jamps or something. Or it might not make any goddamn difference. Who knows? We might just be doing this for our own satisfaction after all. Excuse me. Alright, so we've already lost the chalice. Um, this will take away our grippy gramps. Uh, number three should be the lunar breastplate or whatever? Which, ah, man, I fucking assume it's the clay suit or whatever, right? Because that got us up into fucking space after all. Ouch. So what the hey ho? Ah, uh, fucking... I can't hear that. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Okay. Well, let's just keep going with this. Maybe we'll find something of value. Who knows? Alright, so that one definitely takes us out. Where does this one go? Oh, right, okay. That was for the, um, the doppelganger. So now, my presumption is... that the door down here is going to be this, right? Or is this still gonna murder? Did I already try this and it murdered me straight up? Yeah, okay, never mind. Never mind, that was, uh, that was a poor choice. <laughs> we have chosen poorly there. Alright, you know what? That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Let's go back to, uh, where's the Dark Sky Lord, whatever, here we go. So let's go back to that room that supposedly had the solution to it, like, literally right inside. Right inside the room. Which I doubt, but hey, this might be one of those literal type things where it's like they're they're telling me the answer, but it's but I don't believe them or something. Let's see, we gotta go down. Okay, we gotta go over to the right and then down one and then to the left. Right, so we did this again and opened up this little tiny ass path. That's like, oh, something, something, you know, whatever. Prepare for Jonas to have a wicked heart. Innocent heart knows no wickedness. Innocent heart can balance the scales. The undead and meat will render the judgment. Okay, cool. Cool, I guess. Stranger's own the scales mentioned, blah, 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 blah. Used to weigh the sins of the dead. Takes the name from one of the supreme deities, bro. I can't get up there to stop my own, can I? Of course not. How fucking silly would that be? Stranger's own the things, blah, blah, blah. Desired both bodies and souls of those judged by Anubis to be heavy with sin. The fuck does that mean? Um. Heavy with sin. So, I have to be not heavy with sin. It's going to weigh me. Wait a minute. 
So, uh, hold on, hold up, hold up. Weigh the sins of the dead. I'm gonna look something up right quick. Because I... Mm, I've got an idea. It's a stupid idea. But sometimes stupid ideas... Um, end up being solutions. So here's my idea, right? This sounds like a literal puzzle now that I've read it for like the third or fourth time. Do they literally want me to be weightless? AKA have zero weight to my name? Because I've got 103 of those motherfuckers. That's gonna take a while to get rid of them all, unless... Wait a minute, there was a dude somewhere that would take all of our shit if we gave it to him. I think it was the dude we repeatedly kicked in the balls. Um, where the fuck was he? Uh, ew. Where was that motherfucker? Did I write it down, maybe? Hmm. Well... I'm getting like a, I'm getting a vibe from Ancient Chaos here. That there was a dude somewhere here that was like, "Hey, give me your shit." Uh, oh, there's a thing up there. Hold on a second. Hundred three weights is a lot of weights, and I don't want to give all that up. But yeah, here's the dude. He's like, "Hey, give me your shit." How about I kick you in the ball? <laughs> Let's kick him in the balls for old time's sake. Just once. Okay. Um. Let's just take weights. Okay, so that zeroes out my weights, right? So now I'm weightless. In a very literal sense. Um, so okay. This is a dumb theory, but hey, we'll go with it. I. Uh, it's. Mm. <laughs> Like, I've had dumber ideas, right? So... Honestly, this'll... This'll slot in as, like, the fifth dumbest idea I've ever had. Maybe. Not that I'm keeping track or anything. Uh, did I want to go this way? No, I want to go... Yeah, I want to go down. I give it a cash, too, huh? Well, that would be interesting, if they want me to have no weights and no cash. We already did the no cash puzzle, though. That was the thing where we crossed the river Styx in Eternal Prison. So my guess is it's not that. Um, I guess we'll just give it a go, huh? We'll see what happens. Are you fucking serious? That was it, huh? Do do ba do ba do. There's Mott's Feather. Okay. Well, cool. Now we're down 103 weights. <laughs> so we just gotta go buy some more, I guess. I hate that that was the solution. I really do. Okay. Well, now we've got Mott's Feather, and we just found Anubis. So we should be good to go. Um, but I guess before we go, we should go buy some more weights. So we, you never know how many you're gonna need, right? Should be a shop with them around here somewhere, is right? Uh, ammo. Ammo wouldn't be a bad thing to have, either. I thought somebody was selling weights around here, what the fuck? How about this one? There we go. Ten bucks for five weights. Sure, I'll buy that. I'll buy a bunch. We'll buy, like, fifty. And I hope that's enough for the rest of the game, but who really knows? Cool. Uh, 
Okay. Back to Eternal Prison. Because now we can go talk to Anubis and say, Hey, motherfucker, here's Mott's Feather. We have been judged. Uh, how do I get back to that area, though? I just need to get back to the first area, but I want to get back there without losing my chalice. So is this going to take me back out, perhaps? Or is this going to take me out entirely? Damn it. <laughs> That's not what I want. Spikes again. Oh, well, oh, okay. Fucking ah, it's so annoying. Oh, okay, let's please jump. That'd be real nice. Thank you. to find whatever uh, whatever door gets me out of here. Gets me out of this section. If I can just get to the doppelganger area, I think that'll take me out. Or no, no. It'll only take me to the... Eh. Yeah, no, I'm not sure where I'm going. Okay, maybe that'll... Will that take me out? I feel like it was one of these up here, wasn't it? Because that takes... Mm, where does that one take me, actually? I'm not even sure. I feel like that'll take me somewhere but lose my chalice. Ah, okay, there we go. That's kind of what I wanted. I didn't take the chalice from me. Alright, that's good. That's good. That's good. So I can climb up here, yada yada. Uh, I need to get over to the right, which is up there. Close to another refill too, which would be actually rather nice right about now. Ouch. If this dude wants to hop on down so we can get some more green juice, perfect, see? Easy peasy. Alright, guess what, motherfucker? We've got this Feather of Judgment or whatever. Eh? Used to see Guidance of the Cyrus and you must solve my riddles. Okay. Okay, cool. Riddles. We're good at riddles, I think. <laughs> Sometimes. Alright, let's see what these riddles are all about. Prove your worth, prove your worth. We detest the intensity of pain. Hopefully we will not have to endure that which we detest. We hold the frozen ground at our feet. Joyce for will be rendered powerless, and we will be rendered powerless. 
Uh... Okay. <laughs> here they come in while they're living. Stand on the precipice of a dune and see the extent of your courage, and two of us will disappear. Okay. Well, it's the fear of the unspoken. You have come in the world of living. Stand before the wheel of ages. You'll hear the extent of your enchanted silence. Then two of us will disappear. Uh. Hmm. Okay. What does all that mean? <laughs> Solve the three riddles. Simply do exactly as is written. Okay. Um. Simply do what is written, huh? Frozen ground at our feet. That that reads the shrine of the frost giants. Precipice of Doom, and you'll see the extent of your courage, the two of us will disappear. Precipice of Doom sounds like that, um... That, uh, pit where the crushy hands are, right? Fear of the unspoken, you have come from the world of living. Stand before the Wheel of Ages. Hear the extent of your encanted sign. That sounds like just stand in front of something for a bit. Uh... You know what? I should write these down word for word, because I'm gonna forget. I'm gonna forget, and I'll be like, what the fuck did that say? And then it'll be bad, so we can test... Oops. Test the intensity of pain. We will not have to endure. That which we detest. Hold the frozen ground at our feet. This is probably the most confusing of them. You who have come from the world of the living stands at the... Oh, wait. On the precipice of doom. That might mean um, the, the cliff past that cave, you know? Stands on the precipice of doom. You will see the extent of your Karaji. Two of us will disappear. Still in us. The fear of the unspoken. The world of the living. Although that that's that sentence there, you who have come from the world of the living, seems to suggest that this is in the underworld that we need to be doing this, or eternal prison or whatever. Stand before the Wheel of Ages. <laughs> we will hear the extent of your encanted silence. Which is probably just do nothing. Two of us will disappear. Okay. Frozen ground at our Oh, I see. <laughs> okay, that was the first confusing one. The frozen ground at our feet. This is literally icy right here, apparently. Huh. And I just hit it a bunch. 
And it's like, oh, fuck it. You, you solved the riddle. Okay. 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 Um... That's weird. That's weird. Okay, uh, it's right. <laughs> uh, yeah, kind of the world of living who stands on the precipice of doom. Are these literally just shit I've got to solve in this room, do you think? Because that would be good. That would be real nice if we didn't have to go anywhere to do this. Precipice of doom. Where do you think that would be? Like, do I just need to snug up against this real close and be like, yeah. Fucking... Oh. Alright, maybe not. Oh, well, stand before the Wheel of Ages, you'll hear the extent of your intended silence. So there's a wheel just to the left here. Maybe that's it. Like, the wheel, there's literally a wheel just down there, so... First of all, let's fucking get rid of these assholes so we don't have to deal with this. And we'll just we'll just stand here a bit and see what happens. of my encanted silence, aka don't say or move or do anything. Maybe. Yada. No, oh, alright. Let's let it do its thing for a bit. We'll let it make, like, two or three revolutions, I think. And we'll see what happens. Well, I want to get this fucker out of here so we can do this in absolute peace. I let it make a couple of revolutions, because I moved around a bit, and then I put a weight down, and then it's just like, you know what, fuck it. Alright, so let's see. But still in us, the fear of the unspoken, you who come from the world of the living, stand before the wheel of ages, we will hear the extent of your encanted silence. Then two of us will disappear. Because normally I would expect it to go do do pa do pa do if we solve the thing, right? Use the Jed thing with no incantations. Ooh, that's that's an idea. That is an idea, isn't it? Let's try that. I think we can. I think we can turn off everything and then use it. Haha, <laughs> you were right! Wow, what a play. What a play. Eh, well, this is good thinking. Okay, and what, was the, what was the last one? Alright, that one was done. Stands on the precipice of doom. Okay. Um, I think I know where this one is. Uh, how do I get back there, though? My guess is gonna be that we can probably do it like... Uh, this, perhaps? So first we're gonna save, because we did those two. Um, well, I can think of two things for Precipice of Doom, right? Uh, how do I get to the first one? 
think we can go back through here. No. Alright, you know what? This this works. Oh! What? Wait. What? What? Was that literally just it there? <laughs> um... Okay, I've got a few questions about that one. Why... Um... Why? <laughs> I guess I just have the one question. Why? Ah, uh, shit. Uh, hmm. Well, that's a fucking... Will you fucking let me out of here? Thank you. Oh, yeah. oh ah, shit. Okay, I'm I'm very confused as to why that worked. Because that was definitely not the thing that I was thinking of. Yeah, son of a bitch, there goes those things. Alright, well what is that what does that earn us now? What pray tell does that get us? Oh, Osiris, okay. Hiding here quietly, what do you want with you? Uh Tell me about the fifth children. When the previous generation has been destroyed by the moon, there's no way to fight bags from the only recourse is to escape the outside world, or to the outside world. People being born from clay should be less bound in the mother's will, so you decide the fate of those living now. Is there something else? Tell me about the sky people. Little bastard with crystal skulls. They seem to be long extinct. It seems as though the blah blah blah. Seems as though they came to this world with the intention of ruling over it. Haha, <laughs> good luck, fuckos. They faced the obstacle that was another and formed Lamalana itself. They also sought to seal off Leg Egg 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 Lana. So have taken time they didn't have. I doubt their goals will ever be achieved now, and it's precisely because those whom they left behind continue to live that the world is now in such turmoil. That sucks. Yeah, give me some treasure, I guess. I oh, intend to use it, but the underworld is a good place for hiding treasure. If someone is demanding that you bring it to them, then do so. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Alright, that's what we were looking for. Uh, no, thanks, Osiris. That is precisely what we wanted. Thank you. We out. Alright, that is like the beginning of a four-item fetch quest. <laughs> oh, man. It's so lame. Alright, Samara, we've got the light side for you, honey. How about you unlock the chest above us? Oh, that's gonna be a boss fight, huh? Ah, uh, okay. Alright. Alright. Um, so this is no no longer poison, huh? Okay. You know what? I know I'm gonna die here, so let's just do like a... Let's do a quick info gathering run. See what we're up against. See what kind of garbo we have to deal with. Search, sure, search, sure, search, sure, search. Sure. Oh. Uh, uh, oh, he's doing. Oh, that's, not, that's probably gonna be instant death, isn't it? If I get crushed by that Garbo. Oh! No? It just does a lot of damage. <laughs> okay. Good, good, good show. Good show. Let's go get some more health. <laughs> I, I figured it would just unlock the chest and we'd be golden, but I suppose it makes sense that we need to fight another D-bag for it. Oh, that's actually safe, but... Okay, for serious now. Alright, what do we think is going to be most suited for this? What the hell is this D-Bag's hitbox anyways, do we know? Oh! Oh, right there, okay. He did his little what? Oh! Jesus, excuse me! Sir, that didn't seem very fair. <laughs> Just fucking punch the shit out of us, ouch. Oh, I can I can do things too. Hey, how about you? Yeah, eat shit, asshole. 
Okay, now he's gonna punch from the left again, right? Ouch. Ooh, nice. Okay. Well, do that. Ow. Yeah. Ouch. Hey, fucko. Alright, that. That seemed to work, you know. This might be doable just with no oh shit, with normal ass strats. Uh oh. Go! Oh, alright. A little punchy. He's getting a little punchy. Good for him. Although I'm sure there's gonna be like a dumb ouch. Fucker. There's gonna be like a dumb second phase or something. Bet you any money. Hey, ding dong. Oh, he's doing a lot of damage. I don't like that. Eh. Oh. Ouch. Ouch. <laughs> Do a second one? No? Oh, ow. Oh, whoops. <laughs> uh, it was a little, a little late on that jump there. Okay, you know what? If this, if this is what it is, like, just some action platforming type shit, we can deal. We can deal with this. Gotta work the patterns, you know? We can deal with that. This already feels a lot more fair than, than the echidna fight, you know? Second punch, no? Just the one? Oh, punch. Eh. Fucking. Ow. Ah. Oh. Oof. Ah. Jeez, son of a bitch. Oh, he's dropping shit too. Hey, asshole. Stop that. Excuse me, sir. Oh, yeah, this is fair. Um, please get up and out. Get up and out of it, idiot! Ugh. Yeah, good. Swimming physics. The best. The best. The best, the best, the best. Alright, that's okay. That's alright. Oh, come on, 
hey, keep doing that dumb bullshit. That's alright, that's alright, we're getting it. I don't think any of the sub-weapons would really help too much here, unless... well, hold on a second. We'll, we'll give the, uh... I don't know that that does as much damage as a flail whip, but... Give it a go. Every time we're inside his nostrils there. Ouch. Yeah, I don't know that that's doing nearly as much as we want it to. Whoa, excuse me, sir. done three punches in a row. Um, sir, please. Uh, none of this bullshit happens, so yeah, that's fair. Get out of the goddamn magma, poison! Oh, for God's sake. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. God oh. oh, damn it! <laughs> what a shit. What a shit, asshole. Alright. I suppose my other option is to put the clay suit on. Um, but that also takes out the double jamps, so that's probably no good. What <laughs> do you think infinite rocks cost nowadays, huh? Uh, probably more than you'd want to pay, let's be honest. Yeah, you only get like three good groupings of that, and then infinity's done. Oh, bastard. Will you fucking let me get up there, asshole?
Oh, jeez. Excuse me, sir. Oh. Ah. Did you can get up there, dumb nuts? Oh, yeah, this is going to real fucking well. Jesus, he is pissed. He's pissed about something. I'm not even sure what. It's like I'm beating his ass and there's nothing he can do about it. Oh, oh he's getting he's getting real feisty. Uh, um, um, uh, <laughs> sir! Oh no! Uh, come on! Oh, oh, he's almost dead. Come on, come get you some fucko. Oh, okay, good. Oh damn it! Ow, oh, son of a bitch! That's okay, we're getting closer. See, this feels a lot better than the Echidna fight. I feel like I'm making progress. And not just flailing at bullshit, you know? hits in there, and he got like 20 billion, so good. Yeah, 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 perfect. Yeah, that's fucking fair. Serious with that. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, eat my ass. Have your temper tantrum elsewhere, you fucker. Okay. Oh, that was a bad show. A bad go of things, but that's okay. This time we'll get it. This time we'll get it. I think I just need to let him do that, and then I can wail on him for a bit. <laughs> that seems to be the better idea. Then there's also this, where I can get a bunch of free hits and shit. It's fun, fun and cool. Time, numb nuts. Yeah, come and get some. All right, that went pretty well. <laughs> that went pretty well, considering. <laughs> 
I don't know if that's the correct term. Journey is nearing its end. Oh, usually they say that, but the journey continues. We fucking did it. All right, so that was what number ten, number nine. I don't fucking remember now. All right, we did it. We fucking murdered him, and now we've got to get this thing. Should be what the fire thing or whatever. Hey, look at that, the flame torque. Oh, that's sick. Alright, um... Cool! So we did it. Um... We got Tamara. We got that chest. Tamara's the flame we got. I don't know what the fuck this one is. Sun and Moon to Vidafnir. Oh, now we can go fucking fight Vidafnir in the weird twisted dragon thing. Uh, in Immortal Battlefield, right? I think? No? Uh... Wait, where was that? Where was that weird dealy bop thing? We can definitely fight Vidafnir. So we got the fire thing, right? And that's what we needed. The V is probably silent. What V? What V be you talking about there, Chief? Um, okay, so we got the light side. Uh, where the fuck was this other dragon fight that we needed to do now? Big ass dragon, how could you- how can you forget? Seriously, where is it? Didn't I write that down? Oh, right! Cross giant, Fafnir, Fafnir, Fafnir. Uh, let's let's try that. Let's try going to murder that one now. Uh, 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 there. <clears throat> well, don't picture the ast. Why are you picturing the ass dragon? What? Why would you do such a thing? That seems like a, a bad idea. And I would never advise you to picture an ass dragon. Why would you do it? Ouch. Uh, oh. Well, actually that was kind of helpful to drop down this far. <laughs> Alright. Cool. Um, plus we can get a fairy for our trouble. Should be a red fairy? Yeah, alright. Excellent. Um, I think we can hurt this dragon now, right? You could be like, hey, oh, F Fenrir, sorry. Yeah, eat shit. Baffy on the nose. Oop. Oop. I suppose I don't want to get too far forward, otherwise they'll crush me. Oh. 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 <laughs> okay. That can also happen, apparently. Um, good to know. Good to know. Alright, so now I actually kind of wonder, we're going to try some, some pro-level strats here. <laughs> or what I presume to be pro-level strats. We're going to just run forward and beat the shit out of this motherfucker. We'll wait for him to do his thing. Oh! Okay. Cannot do that. <laughs> Can't do that. That's, uh, that's good information to have. We 
good information to have there. Okay, that's fine. We can we can take this nice and easy and just beat the shit out of him the normal way. Ouch. Is this actually hurting him, or do I just need to beat the shit out of him to make him open his mouth, and then I can actually damage him? Shit out of the inside, dude. Or it'll start causing damage, apparently. This guy should have been long fucking dead. Alright, bye, Healy Fairy. You helped me out as best you could. You really did. I don't think anything but a direct weapon hit hurts him, because it needs to have the little flame effect to it. That's why I'm going balls in with the, uh, flail whip here. So I tried the spears, that didn't work. Like, nothing indirect really hurt him.
jaws of life on me. that there's this like this weird little platform thing that I just fall off. It seems kinda weird to me. There's that bullshit that happens. Haley Fairy, thanks. I'll try to do the rest of this on my own. Would you toast my shoes? Thanks, fucker. Okay. Cool. use with my fairy here. As soon as she leaves, I'm pretty much dead in the water.
Okay, good. I'm down to purple while she's still hanging around, so that's good. Oh, now she's gone. Dang it. <laughs> Had to say something. Oop, okay. Okay. Okay, can we hit him, please? Maybe? Okay, if I don't totally duck this up again. Yeah, eat shit, asshole. Do do ba do ba do. Um. Um. What is that? <laughs> uh, excuse me, sir. Sir. Excuse me. Then she had the well guarded by mirror. Narcissa said to be a well in the land of the most nice knowledge and wisdom are hidden. The well is guarded by a giant mirror. Holds water is kind of liquor that stimulates brain function. Liquor that stimulates brain function, huh? Way ahead of you. It's called thinking juice, thank you. Um, so. Hmm. <laughs> Uh... How about Wish? Or maybe I just use the, uh, the vessel, perhaps? No? No? I think I need to do something else with this to activate it, but hey, we did it. Uh, Mimir... Uh, liquor, I guess. Alright, so that's one thing we could beat with the the fire thing. Let's go try to beat, um, the Dothmir now. That's the other thing we know we can do. Jump, idiots! Pay attention to the fucking things I tell you to do! Alright, dial down the casual sexism there, please. That's not funny or cool. this fucker. Yeah, let's 
again, it's not really the fight that's challenging, it's dealing with these goddamn physics. Whoop! <laughs> Bastard. Oi. Okay, cool. That was a fun fight. Alright. Time move out of the way right away, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, none of that hit him, huh? Wow, what a fucking great hitbox. That only seems to affect me. Perfect. Boy, that's awesome. What does that do? What, 32 a, a crack there? Good at getting back here at the very least. Okay, why did that second one not hit him? <laughs> Excuse me? Alright, maybe I just gotta be a little bit patient. Work the pattern a little bit, you know? Whoa, well. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, just jump right into it. That's a good fucking idea.
hit him? Excuse me? Like, what exactly is this fucko's hitbox? Oh, apparently the bottom middle doesn't hurt me. Okay. Ugh. Let's hit him! Jesus. dead. Ooh. Okay. One more bop and he's dead. Yeah! Fucking get some, idiot! First try. Now, what did that... What did that do for me? <laughs> that lets me go back. Um... So I guess that's good, but... Uh... <laughs> Can I get out of this room? Like, what's... what's the deal here? No, like, destructible walls or anything to get me out of here, so... Why would one... care about that door? Hmm. Okay, well, whatever, he's dead. That's the best we could hope for. bothering us anymore. <sighs> Alright, well... Hmm. So that probably gets rid of the... Um... The stone statue things, right? Where were the fuck were those? I was in... Second half of Eternal Prison, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's go back. So this might finally get us to Sakit or whatever, right? Because there's the stone statue of Adofner guarding his... tomb? I think? I don't know. Hard to tell. Hard to tell what shit is anymore. Are you even fucking... Maybe I want to go over here. Go up and around. 
around anyways. Uh, uh, yeah, oh, nice. <laughs> okay, we'll take it. Uh, I need to drop down one anyways. Yeah, here we go. So that thing should go away. Excellent. So now what, though? <laughs> God damn it, get up there! Fucking physics. Alright, um, so we got this giant sloop, right? Oops. Put that. And here, nothing. Alright, so what was it? This words of Sakit's former association, right? Uh, so him in? No? Uh, him and, uh, Moon? Nani? Um... Hmm. Maybe that's not the one I need to do it in? I need to do it in this one instead? Ah! <laughs> oh, damn it! I hope I saved, right? Okay, good. It saved me here. <laughs> that would have been real bad. Okay, so obviously not in that one. Or at least not those words in that one. Oof. For God's sake. It's fucking jump, man. associated with Sabat. Like, I'm gonna be real disappointed if that 11th mantra isn't Sabat. Like, we've had some good times with Sabat. Fuck you! Oh my goodness. Could you. <sighs> Asshole. So we know not to just blindly chant mantras in the right one, I guess. <laughs> that's the that's the place where they don't want you to say the bad words. Um oh! 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 Ooh. Okay. Um <laughs> Alright, we'll just not go into that one, I guess. Uh, dissonance, blah 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 blah, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, you know, whatever. Okay, I, I hope we can just leave the room and reset that, because that seems like it's important. There we go, okay. Uh... Oh! Whoa, jeez! Okay, uh, apparently just moon. Just moon on that one. Good. <laughs> Good, let's be done with that fucking section of it. Okay, this looks like it's Sakit's. Uh, giant salute maybe now? Doo doop a doop a doop. And it's Sakit, not relieved of both power and regret, but I wish to have one final drink of liquor. Power is this one, would you bring me my final drink? Yeah, I, I would, but if I knew how to get it. We could fucking raise a glass together. I'd definitely do that with you, but um, all right, cool. How though? Uh, this 
bitch. Alright, we did it though. We, we did the right thing. We did the right thing in the left mound. As confusing as that is. Alright. So we just beat Vidofnir or whatever, the big chicken asshole. Who was hiding the well of Mimir. Or no, that was, um. Vidof. No, Vidofnir? Fafnir. Fafnir, the dragon thing, right? Um. Let's see here. Okay, we already did Dark Star Lord thing. We're an embankment above prison. We already did that, right? Statue of Adafnir. Uh, Pete needs liquor. Don't we all, bro? Uh, okay. Pete. So. What the hey ho? How how does one do? Eh. 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 Destiny Tablet, we got that one. Valor and the Seeds of Hellfire, I think we got that one already. Lords of Sakit's former association, we did that. That one I'm not sure that we did yet. Uh, hmm. uh. How the fuck does one... Let me take a quick scan through the shit that I've got written down. I feel like we should have this already. Let's need a tablet from Anzu. We already got that, right? Honor room for the judgment. We did that. Nibiru. We got that. Did those three. Mm -hmm. Use excessive power. We did it. We did that one already too, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, 
drama puzzle, I guess, so I'll mark that one. So I knew this to solve the riddles, we did that one. Defeat Searcher, yeah, to defeat the Daphne to the Flame, we did that. Sun Moon of the Daphne, we did that. See, all I've got now written down that might be related is the, the weird tablet prophecy things, right? Sacred Wine of Wisdom, yeah, okay, we sort of did that. <laughs> Mirror, Shrine of Frost Giants, yada yada yada, yeah, we did that. Up there is the Son of the Sacred, yada yada yada, Farm Farm, it's so it's... What's this? End Wind, Wish Eternity, Night Eternity, Child Throat, Mother. Close, I guess. Missing? Okay, wait. So, missing. That's part three. Part four. Missing, wish, and howl. That's what I got. That's all I got. Um, we need to go back to Frost Child. Go back down to the Mimir statue and try this bullshit out. Like if, if this works, again, this is a dumb theory, but if it works, it works, I suppose. It's the three that I got. Oops. Excuse me, everybody. Our, uh, let's see. Uh, missing wish howl. Scream, maybe? Does that equate to howl? No? Is that not right? Hmm. Hmm. I didn't... I don't have one that specifically says Howl, and if it's not literally Howl, then I doubt that one actually works. So let's take a quick scan through... Uh, the non-areas. <laughs> Is there a non-critical item we could pick up later? Uh, which one are you thinking of there? Because if we're going to be running around, checking on some bullshit, and it's on our way, we may as well pick up whatever it is. The only thing I can think of now is... First of all, let's check what it, what, Wait, what is what's-his-face? Here. Samarantha, right. Blah, 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 impossible, blah, 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 blah. Too busy, yeah, okay, thanks. No help. No help whatsoever. The Spalder. Uh, I would love to pick that up if I knew where it was. Oops. I don't know why I did that. Ouch. Ow. Bitch. Oh, 
Oh wait, what did that say? Kidna's chamber. Well, we beat the shit out of Echidna already, didn't we? Hmm. Is there... Like, this room feels awful empty for some reason. Like, what the hell is this? What the hell are they trying to pull? Oh, uh, ah, shit. Oops. Um. What did I have equipped there? Wind, Mother, Scream... Oh! Okay, this is way the fuck back... ...in Hall of Malice. They said, scream your wish at Echidna. And we're in Echidna's room, right? Okay, that makes sense, even if I did it completely accidentally. Jesus Christ. Wow. Alright. Cool, I guess. Is this the last one, too? Son of a bitch, it is. Ugh. I hate that we did that accidentally. That's lame. <laughs> Super lame. Okay, cool. I guess that makes sense. That was something we learned a long time ago. Yeah, it kind of sucks that it wasn't Sabat. I feel you. I feel you, man. Well, son of a bitch. Okay, um, I guess we should go talk to Elvis or whatever and get the second meaning of this. It's probably going to be... Howl, I guess? It's the only thing we're missing. Um, do we have our thing charged? We do not. Spaulders in the eternal prison gloom, gloom side. Okay, okay. Well, we'll be headed back there in a, in a hot second or whatever, so... Something special to find it. Something special is in, like, a... A key fairy or something, perhaps? That's pretty goddamn special. I think. Excuse me. Oopsie. Oops. Oops. It's also the wrong thing. Nice. Nice. We're gonna put those spikes there, it deserves a raise. Got them twice. Because heck, if that item's gonna make me do more damage, I should probably get that sooner rather than later, huh? Alright, Elvis. Tell us about this last one. Howl. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Now, what was it? It was, um... Wish, Howl, and Missing, I think, is what I was gonna work off of for, um... Mimir, right? Let's try that first. Oops, that's the wrong one. Oh, that- what the hell? That's- I swear, that's not, Go to this one. <laughs> that's not the one I told you to go to. Okay, thank you. Oops. Now oh, suddenly the music is all quiet and shit.
Alright, do I have the snow equipped? Sure. Something scream wish howl or whatever. Whatever it was. Yes. Do -do -ba -do -ba -do. That was like prophecy part three and four or two and three or whatever. Oh fucking no. Please stop fucking zoning me out of this. Alright, uh, this should be the liquor? Sacred wine, alright. Yeah, that's close enough. It's no spirits, but it'll do. Uh, okay, so you were saying something about Eternal Prison Spalder. Uh, so let's grab us a key fairy before we go back, I suppose, huh? We know how to get one of those right easy. Plus, we can check in on Mulbrook while we're here. Make sure she's okay. Reminds me in the middle of this year in a battlefield inside a big ass boat. The Soul Gate. Yeah, the nine the nine Soul Gate or whatever. Yeah. And how you get inside there? Any interest is sitting somewhere in the ruins. Can I run that by you again? Yeah, sure. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm good, thanks. I'm gonna go get some sleep. Alright, you you have yourself a nap, Mulbrook. You've had you've had a long day. Get yourself some rust, okay? Red. Red. Oh, red, blue. Because we already got a red from before, right? Red, green, I would guess, right? We're on the same. Yep, yeah, okay. And then red, key fairy, I believe, right? And then key. Excellent. Okay, let's take a quick scan through Eternal Prison then. I'm gonna trust you on this one. As I recall, she doesn't hang around for too long, so we gotta be good about this. Uh... Oh yeah, good. Let's just drop me down again. Thanks, fucko. Try to try to cover as much ground as we can here. C2. Uh I don't think that tracks with our map here. Are we on the wrong side of Eternal Prison? Uh Yeah, we've got a C2, uh. Oh, uh, did I not scan that one? I don't think I scanned that one. We might be uh, out of luck on this one here. You know what? We're here. We're gonna go talk to Saki. And we'll have to re-get the key fairy and then go search for this folder later, I guess. Sakit, we've got your liquor for you. Wasn't easy to get. Hope you appreciate how far we've gone for you. That is almost that sad. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay. Cool. How do I give this to you now? <laughs> do I just kind of dump it on you? Alright, here goes. There you go, buddy. Doo -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. I no longer see you. I know not what sort of being you are. Please join me in my final s Hell yeah, bro! Pour it out for Sakit! Oh. Ah! 
<laughs> it's fucking good. <laughs> oh no! Oh, Lamisa, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, damn. That's funny. And the key fairy is just kind of hanging out there. I love it. Oh, it's rip. Rip Sakit. Alright, what do we got here? Carried out my wish to have my gratitude, I used my last of my power to leave this record. The sense of our race resides in our commemorative monument. Oh, a mausoleum of the giants. Yeah, okay. Check the hole gouged in my companion's breast. And can't the words of which Leto dreamt. Uh, okay. I hope we know what those are. Erase, rest in peace. Maybe my Leto fell by my hand, rest in peace. Oh, kinda feels. A little bit of feels going on there. Doo doo pa doo pa doo. Rips a key. You weren't such a bad guy even though you tried to kill us in Lama Lana 1. Alright, so... Um... Da -dum -da -dum -bum -bum -bum. Mausoleum of the Giants, right? He finessed his wife. Yeah, he was tricked into killing his wife by, uh... by one of the other giants. Isn't that fucking twisted? That's really... that's messed up, man. That is messed up. Alright, gate of guidance we don't need to be in. We need to be in, uh... Lance Mausoleum. Do 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 Sparkling, sparking the conflict between the giants when he attacked Leto. Until he embedded a key and beat it in Leto's body before falling into slumber. Yeah, okay. That's that definitely tracks. That tracks is what we've been told. I think if memory serves for La Milana One, the hole in the chest is over here. Ew, yeesh. Yep. Uh, okay, so chant something something Leto. I want to say it's heaven, but I, honestly, I don't know. It's... Uh... Yeah. Well, if it's a single one, we can brute force it, right? Oh! Whoa, oh, jeez. Well, I think we found it. <laughs> Hell yeah, brute forcing. Boosh! Okay, I think... Is that number three or four? I want to say that's number three. Because we had one from the very first one from Vritra, right? We had the one up on the moon, or up in space or whatever, and then this one. Was there another one in between there? <laughs> I don't know. Tell me how many we have? <laughs> no, it doesn't. That's lame, kind of. Alright, well, failing that, I suppose, let's go try to get the, uh, the Spalder, I suppose, right? So that means we need ourselves a Keeper.
Probably. I mean, I'm assuming so. Like you said we need something special, right? Uh, the key fairy is well, excuse me, about as special a thing as I can think of right now. Alright, so the next one is the key fairy, right? And you said, what was it? C2? Uh... How the hell do we get back there, though? So I can warp into the gloom part of it. Uh, Alright, I think I've got a plan. I think. Oh, green is not the one we want. Or is red. Okay, I've got a plan. I think. Uh, so let's go, blah, 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 blah. So this is the gloom side of it, but I think we need to be in the other side. So, it should get us over there. This just drops us in here, right? And then, so let's see, C2 would be right there, right above the gap. So, I think then... Um, need a door to the other side, so we need to go over here. I ain't got time to deal with these motherfuckers here, so if you guys want to move the fuck along... Oh! Uh... Okay. I don't know what happened there. It destroyed everything, so hey. Hell yeah. Um, this might get me there? Okay, so now we're there. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh... We did it! <laughs> oh, my fire whip ignited the shit, huh? Oh, that's kind of rad, actually. Oh. Oh, it's doing something. Do doop a doop a doop. Well, there it is. Uh. Uh. The fi oh, the fire, the fire thing I just picked up, right? The, the fire torque. Here. No, that's the Vajra. Where's the fire torque? Here. Hey, Spalder. Oh, damn! Look at that motherfucker. That's looking sick. Okay. Cool. Um, you know, it's probably safe to say I never would have figured out where that was. Like, is there a hint to it somewhere that we skipped, missed, and didn't write down, probably? Because hmm. then this is the, um... It's, it's not making me fire any faster. Didn't we have something in Lava Lana 1 that made us hit faster? Was that not a thing? Hmm. I guess it doesn't really matter. The important thing is we found it eventually. Okay. So, while we're in Eternal Prison, then, let's, um... Let's have a think about this Seven Gates puzzle thing. Uh... Hmm.
so Divine Chalice, we know we got that, right? Golden Gleaming Wrist Guard, we know is the Grippy Gramps thing, the, the claws or whatever. Lunar Breastplate. Lunar Breastplate. Do we have anything even remotely close to that? Like, the closest thing to a breastplate we have is this, right? But it's not, there's nothing lunar about it. Besides looking, you know, kind of fashionable, I suppose. I don't know. Uh, rustic clothing? Do we have that? Rustic, okay, so this is garb and it's literally described as rustic, so we've got that. Golden wings is likely the feather, right? Something repurposed. Ice cloak? Ah. Oh! An anchor cut from a special rock, repurpose it. Something repurposed. Okay, so we've got that. And the glove of power. It's so bad. We have that. So we have everything about the lunar breastplate, it seems. Unless I can turn the torque back on, I suppose. Alright, alright. The power glove, right? Grippy Gramps, the ring doesn't matter, really. Snowshoes doesn't matter. Flame Torque we just got, that doesn't match anything. Yeah, Fibula, breast... Breast-mounted accessory. Is that considered a breastplate? I feel like it doesn't, but... Maybe it does? <laughs> uh, hmm. Does that count? I mean, the only thing that really points me this direction is it literally says... It literally says, breast mounted in the description for it. That's the only thing that makes me think breastplate, but... I, um... <laughs> Okay, I mean, we're here, right? Um, I haven't saved since we did the thing, so let's save quickly. Oh, I can't use the grail. Fuck. Um... Whoa, jeez, uh, uh... <laughs> that. How the fuck do I get out of here? Can I get out of here like this? Okay, good. We definitely need to go back there, though. So, uh, let's get the fuck out. So maybe that's why that, um, other gate was killing us all the time. It's because I didn't have the thing actually equipped. Damn, look at that. With the fire and the spalder equipped? That looks fucking sick as hell. Alright, well, let's give it a go, you know? It's getting kind of late, so we're gonna have to wrap this up soon. But let's give it a go while we're thinking about it. So, if we're kind of following this the way we were before... Let's go through here. This should reset everything. Will it take away my... Oh, no. It didn't... That wasn't the... Wait, what? That wasn't what I was thinking it would do. Uh, and also I need to turn off the fire thing because I'm gonna blow myself up otherwise. Oh, here! Okay, this is- this is perfect. This is perfect. Actually, this is where we want it to be. Hmm. Guess that does do what it advertises. Okay, so here's the one that will destroy us if we don't have whatever, right? Nope! That literally kills us anyways. Okay. <laughs> so that's a no-go, still. Um, so either that's not the breastplate, or that thing just murders you regardless. Huh.
Hmm, well, maybe we should quit while we're ahead for tonight, then. Because, let's see, we we got a new item. We got the Spalder, right? Oh, and the, and the Fire Torque. So that's good. We're still missing one, two, three, four, five things. And a Sigil. And a whole bunch of garb, which I presume is probably just aesthetic stuff. We got the Scythe, too. Right, 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 right. Which we gave to Samara, sort of. Apparently we kept it anyways. Uh... Hmm. Well, let me do a quick... Do a quick assessment of our maps here. Let's see what else we got. The mirror I'm just gonna delete, because we got everything that was up there. You know, we could go talk to What's-Her-Face and see if there's anything else she can tell us. Uh, Ice Fire Treetop. Uh, probably the other one. Uh, What's-Her-Face Modgut, I think? She was the one that was telling us about the Eternal Prison? It's like, hey, go, uh... Go talk to Nettie or whatever. So we did. Okay, so that's not good. Uh, except I don't remember where she was exactly. Uh, top left, maybe? Damn, I will say that this thing is doing some serious work, though. I like that. This Nettie? Or Modgut? Yeah, Modgut. There we go. Further along, the harder it becomes to return as each pass the gates closes. Find yourself truly locked between the gates and you have no recourse but to get up, give up, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, please. Alright, so she doesn't tell us anything more. Thanks. Thanks, Modgut. Modgud? Swedish? We're telling us first to enter the eternal prison. The enter the eternal prison is to defeat the terrible bird of the doctor. We did that. We did all this, but we can't get back to that gate without going through the Eternal Prison first, which seems to be counterintuitive. Underworld deity of the Ennead, who possesses the light sight that's held within the Eternal Prison. Yeah, we already got that. That was Osiris, right? Okay, well, at least we know what was going on there. Oscar slumbers. That's the weird squirrel thing that's really Herzvalur, right? Trace the illusion's path and seal it. Then the true body will awaken. What the hell is that? Mean? Trace the illusion's path and seal it. So I remember something in La Mulana 1. Where we had to remember where we fought bosses or something in order to trace something else, which I eventually just looked up. Is this the same thing, do you think? That we have to go back to wherever we fought this squirrel asshole like four times? Oh, if that's the case, that kind of sucks. If that's the case, then that kind of sucks because I have no idea where we fought this fucker all those times. Uh, I suppose I should at least write this down. Where are we at? Ice fire, right? Uh, Ratatosker. Uh, trace path, seal it. Uh, then true body uh, will awaken. If that's the case, then I'm probably just going to look this up, because I'm not going to retrace my steps from, like, 25 hours ago in order to do this. <sighs> you ever find out what that weird symbol you lit up in space did? Weird symbol? Uh, you'll have to be a bit more specific. Which weird symbol? All the, the skulls and shit? We got, um, we got one of the mantras up there, right? Mantra? Mantra? 
the night one, right? Not. Yeah, I think it was just to reveal that mantra. Hard to get the dissonance, too. We got the dissonance. Uh, that was up in Nibiru. AKA space. Space. Uh, hmm. So now I'm not sure what else we can do. Besides look up some shit. Because there's no way in heck I'm gonna try to remember all those times we fought Ratatosku. If indeed that is the thing we need to do. So there's no guarantees that that's true. I'm just kind of guessing based on what we had to do in Lava Lana 1 or something. What's, what was this dude's deal? Come here. What the hell are you proud of being? And this is the beat of Bastard Children and the world came to be the best day and outdoors. Of course, finding four cardinal points held his scar. Skull a lot. It's created the sky. Is that true? Is that a, a mythology thing, too? That's kind of rad. Walls, yeah, we knew about that. Ouch. Uh. <laughs> so, um, we might be done for tonight. <laughs> we might be fucking done for tonight. I feel like we did a lot in a short span of time. Um, and now we're kind of scraping the bottom of the barrel of, of things we have written down and or remember. So, yeah, I guess we will call it there. We will call it there for now. And next time we'll have to maybe start looking shit up. <laughs> Again. Oh, boy. Alright. So that's it for tonight. Uh, next stream will be Thursday night, 7.30 p.m. CDT. It'll be Schmuck Book Club. Uh, with Cyvern the Dragon Weapons and Armed Police Batrider. The monthly and quarterly Schmups, respectively. And then Friday night, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back here on Lava Lana 2. Alright, thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Thursday. Bye-bye.